All right, so we're working in the shop again today. It's a really hot day. It's supposed to be 90 degrees. 90 here in the Pacific Northwest is very rare. And what makes it even more rare is we're doing a hot job on a hot day. We're doing broken exhaust manifolds on a 2006 V8 Titan. It's a Nissan. So, <laughs> As you can see, I got the truck up on the rack. I wanted to determine which exhaust manifold was broken, and I have determined that they're both broken, which stinks. I have replacement exhaust manifolds lying here on the floor. They're expensive. They have a catalytic converter that is part of the exhaust manifold, but both the exhaust manifolds on the truck seem to be cracked right about in this area. They're not super loud yet, and they're not uh, throwing a check engine light, but they will soon. This customer tows a big heavy camper with this big old truck. And the way I figured out how to know or how to know these exhaust manifolds are cracked is I took my tube. This is just a one inch piece of rubber. And with the truck idling, I took the tube and then my ear like this and listened. This creates an echo chamber. Now, on this particular vehicle, it has an electronic throttle, so you can't really wing the throttle from the engine compartment, and that creates a bit of a problem. It makes a ticking noise because of the cracked manifold right in here only when you rev it up. But as I did my sleuthing with my tube, I could put it in this position and I could hear cracks or exhaust leaking from this area and from this area. So. It's kind of a big bummer for the customer, but they're okay with it. They love the truck. Again, it's a 5.6 liter V8. You can see the exhaust manifolds are way deep in here. I'm gonna light just right. You gotta pull the heat shields out of the way to get to all the nuts. You gotta remove the oxygen sensor and you gotta get down underneath here. And you gotta remove all the rusted bolts from the secondary Cali converters move the exhaust back toward the tailgate to get those exhaust manifolds out. You also have to lift the motor mounts or undo the motor mounts and lift the engine. Excuse me. This is not a fun job. And on a hot day, turn the fan on, turn some good music on, and um, maybe a cool drink would help. But uh, this side's broken. And this side's broken. This has the steering rack in the way, which makes it even that much more fun. Again, it looks easy to get at, but there's a big, huge plastic rubber shield in this compartment. Normally, you got to take the big old wheels off and you got to get to work on your V8 Titan because you've got exhaust manifold cracks. You can't have cracked exhaust manifolds. So that's what we're doing in the shop today. We're making somebody's life a lot better. I'm not sure it's the mechanics, but uh, it's the mechanics life. Got to change those manifolds. It's the same manifolds on the Nissan Armada and also the QX40, some type of SUV with the same 5.6 liter V8. Also, be sure to disconnect your battery before you get going and try not to break off any of your nuts for your exhaust hardware. That would be bad. It's gonna to be tough to drill those out. Take your time, soak them with penetrating oil, use a little heat if they're rusty, and good luck to you. I'm wishing good luck to myself. This is not a very fun job, but I guess I took it on, and now I gotta make it right. It'll be better than ever when we're all done. <laughs> Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next job.